Stop right there. Amethyst knows what you did. Did you know that? Amethyst is looking around restlessly at the forest. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to episode 11 of the Pokemon uh, Soul Silver Chance Lock. Almost said Y Wonderlock. My bad. In the last episode, we came through this national park and all surrounding areas and captured Pseudo Wudo. And in today's episode, we're going to be going toward Echo Creek City. So, if you guys are hyped for Pokemon Chance Lock, be sure to smash like button down below for us because y'all already know it's pretty appreciated. And then to the question today. Today's question today is what is your favorite evolution? Now, mine is the one that we are. I don't know, I feel like we have a high chance of getting into this episode. Because, you know. And this has to be friendly enough by now, right? Come on. And let's have a look at our team you see what we're working with here. Now, I did do a little bit of training to just two team members because I knew they were close to evolving. So. Yeah, first of all, we have Amethyst level 20, our mod snake is Eevee. Going to Stew Bell because we want that SB on. Uh, Rock and Tail up, Tackle, Helping Hand, Sand Attack. Then we have QB level 20, our Quick and Naked Vulpix. Um, with Ember, Will, with Computer, and Quick Attack. Then, we have Vicious. Our level 20, Gentle Natured Fero. It's one of the ones I evolved off screen because I knew it evolved soon. You know, I just want, to, I, I want to, I need some more power on the team. Rock and Aerialize, Pursuit, Leer, and the Fury Attack. Then we have our other evolution, our old buddy Cam, level 21, 21, because that's the level it evolves at. Our Adam and Anchor Weeping Bell now, holding, still holding a miracle seed to carve the Vine Whip. Also, Rock can cut a track and sleep powder. I just give it a track, because why not? Then we have Diesel, level 20, our Aeron, holding, uh, holding the Quick Claw, because she's not too fast. Serious, nice and serious Nature. With a head by Iron Head protecting Rock Tomb. Then we have Sleep Drum, level 20, our Lonely Nature Gibble, with Dragon Claw, Dragon Rage, Earthquake, and Sand Storm. I'm standing here because I realized I, in the last house I did not get an encounter on Route 36 because the Sudowoodo that we got was a static encounter and those don't count. And Route 37 is where we got the Stantler. So we have a. Don't think that. I like moved it all around over, over my head. That, that has to be good, right? It's got a five. Hey, boy. Hey boy, we got a five, son, we got a five, son, we got a five, 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 son. And they need a red mail. Alright, so we're gonna catch this need a red mail. Let's tackle it. That should not kill it. Right, Amethyst, come on, please don't kill it. Thank you, Amethyst. Thank you, Amethyst. And then we're also gonna be taking on. Basically, the main reason I got, um, I, uh, I, uh, like, evolved Cam was, because I know there's, I know that we're going to, we're definitely going to get to the Burning Tower in today's episode, and if you guys didn't know what happens to the Burning Tower, there's a rifle battle there, and his Croconoff scares me, because I heard from Turo in the comments of one of the previous episodes, shout out to Silverwalk, by the way. That, um, I mean, I ain't gonna name thing. Cab, Kib, KB. I ain't gonna name, um, yeah. That, um, apparently Croconaut actually had Ice Fang the whole time we were battling it, it just never used it for whatever reason. Which, um, I mean, it does like, made me happy they never used it, but scared that, like, oh shit, he has Ice Fang. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I know there's gonna be a tough double battle coming up, so I think I'm gonna go with. I feel like Cephadrome and Diesel's a good combo. Those are pretty much our two most powerful mons. <clears throat> I mean, I know those other two evolved, but we need to get levels on these guys. <clears throat> Plus, they make a pretty good combo, if I do say so myself. Because there are two Pokemon with, like, really powerful moves. Iron Head and Dragon Claw. And Earthquake. But, eh. And, yeah, I guess like I thought, they had a Wigglytuff and a Clefable. Luckily, they're only level 16, but still. Uh, okay, I'm gonna protect it, I don't know if we're in. I don't want an Earthquake, because, actually, I protected with Diesel, so this, this Earthquake shouldn't affect Diesel. Pro plays over here! Oh, no, Metronome. No, 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 Rock Smash, thank you. That would've been quite effective, and we do not want that. No, do we, guys? No, we do not. Alright, so I'm gonna do mad damage to Wigglytuff and Clefable. Oh, okay, nice crit. 
Knife and crit. And, okay. <laughs> There's two Clefables, okay. So I guess the other person other put one's a Wigglytuff. A Wigglytuff. So I'm gonna Iron Head this Clefable, and then I'm gonna Dragon Claw this new Clefable. Double Slap, we resist that. We quad resist that. Quad resist that. <laughs> Slap me as many times as you like. Much or gnome. Uh, power Whip. Oh, gosh. That's kind of... I guess I knew we could eat that up because it's neutral and... Diesel's defense is very powerful. Well, very high, I should say, not very powerful. And the other table is going to go down, thankfully. Alright, so then, yeah, the other wiggly stuff's going to come out. Um, I'm going to iron head this Clefable, and I'm going to dragon claw the wiggly stuff. <coughs> oh, nice and quick claw pops. Nice and quick claw pops. Get out of here, Clefable. Cleffable. And see if you're going to hit level 21. Not bad, not bad. And Dragon Claw should do monster, monster damage to this wiggly tough. Oh, it's gonna. Oh, another critical hit. Not bad. Wiggly Tuff's gonna crit all day, mate. I don't know what I said. And then Diesel's gonna also hit level 21. So that's pretty great. No? Okay. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna put uh, Amethyst back up front because, like I said in the intro, we want that Espeon. We want that Espeon. Alright, Stantler, we should be able to take you on. I'm gonna take this guy on because, you know, because we're being, being how close we are to, level, to um, leveling up. Because in case, this, in case that one level is our evolution, I gotta go for it. I got to go for it, fam. Fam. Alright. And, uh, oh yeah, shout out to, uh, my friend James, who made an intro for the series, and I, I'm gonna try to put into this episode. I know I said that in the last episode, but I kept trying, and I guess it wasn't working out, so, okay, you need to, mm, god damn it, really? So close. Uh, let's just go into QB. Finish this thing off, because QB needs the experience, too. I suppose just healing, and then getting... Oh my god, the Santler is pissing me off really quickly. Alright, time to test out one of our newly evolved Pokemon. Alright, Vicious, you're a Fero now. You should be able to do all kinds of crazy Fero things. Apparently one of them is not take stomps, but one of them is kill Stantler, so can't argue with that. But apparently one of them is kill Stantler, so... You know. You know. And, okay, Amethyst is not at great health, so... Okay, it's a piggy. We can fuck this bitch up. We can fuck this bitch up. Alright, tackle it. Real quick, lad. Gust, we can eat up a gust. You can eat up a gust. You can eat up a, eat up a, yeah, you can eat up a gust. Tackle, and that should kill the piggy. Bye-bye, mm, piggy. Bye bye. Piggy, go bye bye. Okay, now let's head to Arctic City and heal up. What else? Really, Bill? No, oh, yeah, so I'm Bill. Who are you? Hmm, that one, huh? You, you know what? I'm the one who developed the system to transfer Pokemon. But I couldn't have done it with me alone. For example, do you know the Hoenn Regan? This girl's Lynette from the Hoenn made the Pokemon search system easier to use. I went all over the world, they're working together to improve the Pokemon trade and storage systems, bro. I have to hurry on, get, hurry on back to Golden Rock and see my folks, bro. Bye-bye, bro. Okay. Okay. Mm Let's heal up Amethyst and all of our other Pokemon that took damage slash got put to sleep. Carcio Stantla. Carcio Stantla. Alright, and, uh, so I guess we'll head over to the burn tower, because there's not really much else we can do, right? Right. Yeah, you're right. You're right, guys. You're right, guys. This is Game Boy Gokia. Okay. Alright, so let me get our old dicey dice ready. Oh my god, look at those legendaries. 
All right, we have ourselves a nice and powerful six. Fuck. <laughs> mm, fuck. Um, so that means we don't get an encounter here, but we can still... I want to battle a wild Pokemon, because... And I feel like it. What, what, what would we have gotten? We would have gotten a coughing. Okay. Had that been our first encounter? How we gotten our first encounter? How we rolled a one? How we rolled a one this entire time? I feel like we haven't. I feel like we have not. Oh my god, you eat up. Why do you eat up tackles so well, coughing? Why do you eat up tackles so flippin' well? Let's go into vicious. Let's go into vicious. Poison gas. Curse you, poisoning me. I had, to go to, I had to go back and heal again because I don't have any antidotes. I should probably buy some, huh? It's probably a good idea. I'm going to go do that after this battle. Real quick luck. Thank you, Coffin, for getting destroyed. And this is going to hit level 21. Not bad. Not bad. All right, so let's go. Oh, shit. What? Now this is evolving? Ladies and gentlemen, this is S is Amethyst's true form. Oh my god, look, we have an, we have an SPM following us. SPM, what are your thoughts? Hmm? It's peering down. Okay, you're alarmed by the legendaries. Okay. And yeah, I gotta go run and heal up real quick. And I know that poison will not kill your Pokemon in the field in this gen, so there's nothing to worry about here. I can go back and heal up if I can. All right. <coughs> the, only th the only bad thing about Amethyst is that um, I don't think she's gonna get any po any psychic type moves for a while. I think the next time she gets a psychic type move is gonna be at level 36. I'm pretty sure. If Bulbapedia isn't lying to me and betraying me. So, I want to ask you guys a question in regards to that. Because Amethyst isn't going to get any good psychic type moves for a while, do you think it would be fair for me to somehow, like, teach it a psychic type move? Like, like if I were to trade in a TM, or if I were to trade it into my other game and, like, give it, like, confusion or something. Do you think that would be fair? Just so I have something to use that Amethyst for. Let me know. Down below. Ooh, I said bars. Anyways. Uh, oh, we got this dude. My name is Yusin. I'm on a trail of Pokemon named Suicune. And you are Devin. Got to meet ya. I had rumors that Suicune was here, so I can do a look. Take a look at the basement fl 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 hole in the floor. There, Suicune was down there. I could go on stairs, but I know it would run away in no time. I know, I've tried it many times. Alright. What do you want to say, Morty? My name is Malta. I'm an actual job leader. Because my old friend Yusin is here on the trail of Suicune, I decided to investigate the Bone Tower. I could take a legend about these legendary Pokemon, Suicune and Tanrak. As the gym leader of Ecotique, I must have a proper understanding of it. Alright, um, I'm gonna leave with Vicious in this upcoming rival battle because I can. Because I know what he leads with, so I feel like uh, Vicious is a good leader. Oh, it's you. You must be able to catch a legendary Pokemon and make yourself look strong. That is only a dream. You should legendary Pokemon to be a trainer like me, who's sworn to become the strongest trainer. I bet all Team Rocket Corns is just right for you. Wow, Turo. I feel like he's gonna insult me every time we meet. <laughs> Oh well. Alright, Toro. Fight me. Alright, Ghastly. That's why I led with Vicious, because I know he has that Ghastly. So, Tiana Super Shoot will do. I know Ghastly's physical defense is a booty, 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 booty. Booty, 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 booty. Oh my god. Why are all of his Pokemon based off hacks? It's Ghastly is confused, Ray. His other dude thing, freaking Bat, Zubat, has Supersonic. Come on, Vicious, I believe in you. Yeah. Didn't work out for me in the past, and it didn't work out this time. Get out of here. Get out of here. Nice and 406 EXP for Vicious. Magnemite. Okay, we can't stand on that. I'm going to go into QB because QB needs experience. Okay, um. Ember it up. Ember it up. You're on level 18, damn. Okay. Subson this also has Supersonic. Why do all of your Pokemon and moves look confused? 
Did you hack your croc and not have fucking swagger? Well, actually, croc and I can probably get swagger without hacks, but... Whatever, that's not my point. Really? You're gonna try to parafuse in me. Sonic Boom, we don't talk about those kind of games here, Magnum Mine. We don't talk about those kind of games here. Kiwi, please. Alright, that's it. See if you don't come out. Sonic Boom, that's fine. We can eat up a Sonic Boom, because it always does 20 damage exactly. Catch this earthquake, bruh. Catch this, catch this earthquake, bruh. Catch this, catch this earthquake, bruh. Get out of here. Okay. So Magnemite goes down. After being a bit of a freaking turd. Uh, Croconaut. Oh gosh. Croconaut scares me. Like I said, it does that. We now know it does ice things, so. But then again, I already don't have much other question to go into Cam. Cam, this is your first battle to Weeping Bell. Hmm. I'm very quite scared. Okay, it's male and we're female, so I'm gonna try to attract it. Scary face, thank you for being dumb. No offense, Toro. Just, I meant the AI Toro. If I ever insult the, if I ever insult Toro, I'm, t I'm talking about the in-game Toro, not the real life Toro. Yeah, you in love with me. You bet you in love with this hunk of a bell. <laughs> this hunk of a bell. Myself, 2K16. Okay, um, Vine Whip. We just had to Vine Whip this thing to death. We're adamant nature, and it's stab, and we're a frickin' Weaving Bell. Did I just say frickin'? Okay, that does reasonable damage. I can, I can, I can accept that kind of damage. Alright. Come on, Cam. Come on, Cam! Alright, one more, one more. One more turn of sleep. No! You in love. Yeah, you in love. You love me. You love me. Frick. <gasps> you missed! Yes! Thank you! 95% accuracy! Okay, that was scary. But Cam came through. Cam proved herself. And Zubat. Okay, um, Zubat. I would go into Amethyst, but Amethyst doesn't have any psychic damage. Alright, let's go into Vicious. Alright, level 20. Re Turo, stop insulting me, Jesus Christ. Can you not, can you try to speak one sentence without insulting me and nice crit. Nice and critical hit. Critical hit. Alright, you defeat Ravatoro. I'm not fighting with another weakling ever again. It's just too much playing around. Alright, alright then. But then you do, you do fight me again, so. Oh, whatever. You'll never be able to catch a legendary Pokemon anyway. Okay, you just gotta push me again. Okay, that's fine. What's so fascinating about that wall? Uh, Zero. It's preoccupied by the floor, seems like it may collapse. Well, seeing it like it's collapsed in the f whole area of the floor here. That's entirely possible. Anyways, let's head downstairs real quick, Lack. You know there's stuff upstairs still, but might as well take the stuff down here. Uh, who do I want to meet the legendary Pokemon? Hmm, it's kind of tough. I think Diesel should meet them. Because, you know, Diesel's my, kind of my favorite team member, but yeah. Suicune, can I have you? <laughs> Suicune's my, my favorite out of the three, so. Look at how elegant it looks. It just looks so, oh my gosh. One of my favorite things about Pokemon is, like, one, one of the, one of the, my favorite traits about po certain Pokemon is how elegant they are. Did you say it? Slick and rest by like a blur right in front of my eyes. I have been kissing Suicune for almost ten years, but I've never been this close. I'm all choked up. By the way, it was clear to me that Suicune took notice of your presence. I could treat Suicune like Pokemon are said to come to people only when they recognize their talents. Plus, I'll more aggressive towards Suicune. Anyway, Devin, we'll meet again. Yeah, I'll meet again. Just next time we meet, don't focus blast my air on, please, with your hypno. I don't want uh, Diesel to suffer the same fate as that we evolved it and not be that Glock. Alright, Diesel. You just put, we'll put up fun to meet the legendary Pokemon. one. Uh, okay. Firo. Let's just go back upstairs because that was a pretty important thing to get. Okay. Let's battle this dude. Let's battle this dude because we need the training for the gym. 
You fire me to another trick heart. We need, we need an extra train for the gym because we don't really have much to take on ghost types. I mean, the only thing I think I'd rather bat is Vicious Here's Pursuit. It's really the only thing I can think of that we have to take on ghost types. And, and uh, I think pretty much the entire ghost type gym is like Gassies and Hondras and Gengars, but still. But still. I mean, actually, that's, that's, actually, that just proved my point even more because they all have crappy defense, so. Okay, well, 21 on Vicious. 21. Alright, now they're coughing. Let's, hmm, I want to go into Amethyst at the same time. Because Amethyst has, like, <laughs> really shitty moves. Um, let's go into the Diesel. Let's go into Diesel. Because Diesel is powerful. Our little Aeron over here is powerful. Look at that damage. That damage, though. Smoke screen. Yeah, well, we ain't missing. Diesel doesn't miss from minus one accuracy. Actually, apparently she does. God damn it, Diesel. Come on, Diesel, you're better than this. You're better than this. Apparently you're not better than this. The claw possibly were faster anyway, so that doesn't make a difference. But at least he hit the iron head. Thank you, Diesel, for hitting that iron head. 585 experience and a growlith. Let's go into Cephadrome. Let's go into Cephadrome. I'm pretty sure Cephadrome is also fairly close to evolving. Because I'm pretty sure. Don't you get good bite at like level. Fuck, I don't know. <laughs> level. Fuck, I don't know. I feel like it's like mid 20s though. Low to mid 20s. I don't know, maybe I'm misremembering things. Well, let me think. You get guard top at, like, what is it, 45? So, you have to get good bite at around, I'd say, like, maybe 25? That seems like a reasonable level. Seems like a reasonable level to have a good bite. Mm, good bite. Another one good bites the dust. Alright, I'm gonna grab this Poggy Ball. It's an antidote. We kind of apparently desperately need those because we get poisoned every damn time. Let's fight this... Not this wild Pokemon, let's fight this actual trainer, I wanted to say. Let's fight this trainer. Vicious. Aerialize. Just Aerialize. Thank you for your time, Coughing. Oh, you live, okay. Smog, don't poison me. Thank you. Get out of here. I never want to see your stupid face again, because you smirk and you're... Weird. All right, battle you, and then let's get out of here. Practicing your fire breathing. Don't try this at home, kids. Don't try this at home, kids. Charmeleon. Damn. Damn, you have a charmeleon, don't you? Uh, this thing has dragon rage. Fuck, this thing has dragon rage. This thing has dragon rage. I, I'm going to Diesel because, well, it's like, I mean, we are steel, but we're also part rock, so, Ember, we should be able to eat up an Ember. Yeah. Let's rock to, oh, Quick Claw Pops. Quick Claw Pops. Oh, no, wait, I just realized something. I just realized something. Thank you, okay, thank you, please kill. I was going to say, because we were under 40 HP, and I was pretty sure that thing had Dragon Rage. That thing had dragon raged us. Yeah. I'd rather not think about that. Mother, go away. <laughs> Mother, stop calling me. Stop calling me. Go away. I'd also like to tell go away to this frickin' Rattata. I hate Rattata so much. I hate you. I hate you, Rattata. I hate you. I hate your guts. Mm. I don't really like anything. Anything in guts, really. I wouldn't want to see anything in guts. It would definitely be a pleasant sight to see. It's not weird, like you hate someone's guts. If you take, if you take it literally, that means you literally hate their like intestinal. <laughs> or um, no, I think that's not technically guts. Well, it might be, it kind of is. <sighs> I'm not here to give anatomy lessons. I'm here to attempt, but probably fail to entertain you guys. 
with a very boring and poorly, poor quality custom Nuzlocke that is kind of broken rules. It ha has broken rules because look at what we have on our team. Anyways, uh, I think we have to go to into the dance studio first, don't we? I think we do. I think, I think, I think we do. Hi, hi! Stop dancing, it's like a scary dance. You're like a hula dance. You mustn't push sex request on me. Huh? Are you telling me you don't respect what the customer wants? Well then I'll, sh well, then I'll show you how to dance. I'll show you a great one. Wahaha! <laughs> That's an amazing dance. Look, I can do that too. Look, I can do that too. Walk. We oh, I'm trying to... Walk, I, walk, I, walk. Let me show you my amazing dance. Ready? Okay. I'm trying to move around on the spot. There we go, yeah! Okay, what do you want? Huh, who are you? You dare get in my way? I just spoke to you. I never said I was getting in your way. I mean, yeah, I want to get in your way, but still, I never said I was going to get in your way. Level 12 coughing? Bitch! Bitch! I got a level 21 Fero. Fuck off. Oh, you lived on 1 HP. Great. I bet you're going to poison me. Oh, okay, you're not. That small get a high chance of poison, but I guess I was wrong. You're not gonna be getting really lucky. 292. Oh, that, that was the only Pokemon. Wow, okay, that was easy. Wish I had my staples button. I wish I had a staples button. Oh, no, you make me look like a vil- Uh, because you are a villain? Oops, I have an important mission. If they find out I was wasting time, you're to start over as the lowest Team Rocket Grunt. I better leave now. Oh, yeah, because that doesn't give it away. Oh, right, stay near Team Rocket Grunt doesn't give it away. Sure. What do you say? You must be Devon, correct? That was indeed excellent. Kind and strong. Good at raising Pokemon as well. That person does know what to look for in people. Oh, that was always me talking to myself. Never mind. Alright. Oh god, what do you want? Wonderful! You are so courageous for your age. I was a rare sight to say. I want you to have this. Don't be shy, take it. HMO3, boys! That's it. it, it, it it's a move that lets Pokemon swim across water with ease. Good thing we don't have a Pokemon that can learn Surf, right? Watch. We have zero Pokemon we can, that can learn Surf, so I'm gonna need a, I'm gonna need to bring in a water type. Or, or a Cacklin somehow. Yeah, literally nothing can learn Surf. God damn it. Okay. Well, I think, actually, looking at the time of the episode and where we are, and then I think right here is a good enough spot to interrupt today's episode. So if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to smash the like button down below for us. Because you already know your support is greatly appreciated, but with that, I'm gonna get up out of here. Thank you all once again for your support. Thank you for the end of the video. And I am out. Peace.